Hello friends, how's it going today? My name is Vicky and I'm your host. Um, this week we are doing a collective thrift haul over the past probably like six months. I love going thrift shopping. It is bad. I kind of shop a lot but it's I have really been honing down my pieces so that it's more pieces that I know I will wear for like the rest of my life basically that's at least that's the goal that I'm trying to achieve um so first we can start with what I'm wearing <laughs> I have this fun little brown vest and then these pants are originally the brand Everlane um but I got them at last chance which is like I don't know technically it'd be considered a thrift store but it's like the last resort, I think, before things get sent to be burned, basically. This is the first item. It's a pair of green shorts, green plaid shorts. They kind of look like boxers, but I like that they're longer because I don't really like when my butt hangs out. <laughs> and these are from the brand Old Navy originally, but again, got them at Goodwill. Then I got this top. This is like one of my favorite shirts, probably. It's just perfectly worn in. And it is this paisley print button down. It is originally from the brand Chaps. Um, but yeah, it's really cute, comfy. I got this at a thrift store up north, which is like a small, small thrift store in Flagstaff, I'm pretty sure. And I got these pants, which these are like one of my old time favorite pairs of pants. I feel like I usually have trouble getting pants second hand because I just like cannot figure out my size. And these are a tad too big, but I usually, I kind of like the way that they sit. Um, it's from the brand Bamboo Traders. I really like wearing these pants with this shirt. So this is from Goodwill. Honestly, it might be a swim shirt. It kind of feels like that, or like maybe an athletic shirt. And it also has a built-in bra like kind of like those training bras, but I think it's cool. Uh, there's no tags, but I got this from Goodwill and it looks really cute with those pants. Um, and then I got this sweater. This is in thrift, or I guess this wasn't thrifted because it was a gift. Um, it's originally by the brand Madewell. My aunt gave it to me. I'm gonna put it on because it's kind of cute. <laughs> um, my aunt gave it to me for my birthday because she thought it looked like something Harry Styles would wear. <laughs> uh, this is kind of like those patchwork print bags, but it's a jacket. It's really cute. It's super cozy as well. Nice hood on it. Um, and then this is the brand. <laughs> Next is this shirt. This is also one of my all-time favorite shirts. It's just so, it's just so good. Um, it's this tie-dye printed, kind of, I think it's on linen, I would say, but it's just got such cute little details, like all of the embroidery up there and the ties, and then the sleeves also have ties and a little, like, teardrop. <laughs> Unfortunately, there's not a brand, so I'm sorry about that. Next is this skirt, it's nice, um, it probably goes down to my calves, so it's not full floor length, um, but it's just this nice black and white flower kind of print with dots on it. It kind of looks like it would be sold at like Brand New Melville or something or like one of those newer places um, but I'm pretty sure it's vintage because the tag is like super worn but it says made in the United States uh, and the brand is Ultimate. <laughs> uh, but usually when something's made in the United States like unless it's I don't know a sustainable brand most of the time if it has a worn tag and it says made in the United States, then it's usually vintage. Uh, again, with the skirts, I got this one. This one is also a bit big on me and I just haven't had the chance to um, like bring in the sides because they have the scrunching on the sides and I just need to tighten it because it's super loose and it's like really stretchy fabric. So it's very fairy-esque. <laughs> it's just cool, the two two tiers and the way that it drapes I think is really nice. So I got this skirt. I don't know if there's brand. There is. This brand is called Biggie, B-I-G-I-U-S-A. And this is also made in the United States. So 
I don't know if this is vintage or not, but that would be cool. Um, next, I got this cool shirt. This was from my partner's mom. She got it for me. It's this nice 70s-esque shirt. It's kind of hard to hold up, but usually I'll tie this in the front, kind of like a little collar, and then the sleeves are super wide, which I love. And it scrunches at the bottom. Looks very good with my bell-bottom corduroy pants. <laughs> also, from my partner's mom, I think she got both of the, or she got this one, I think. It, I'm not sure. She either got them at Goodwill or from like this vendor that they know that sells vintage clothes. Um, so we got this, this button up shirt, which is so sick. It has shoulder pads. It's got a little cactus on the front and then a beautiful desert landscape on the back, which I think is so sick. Um, and this is Sport. Dumonde. I'll just show the tag. Also made in the United States. So it's probably, I mean, I'm like pretty positive this one is vintage. And I got this sick vest. I love vests. I would like more that kind of fit like this one. Um, but this one is just like the perfect grandma, <laughs> grandma vest. Um, and it's just got the most adorable little flower buttons. That detailing is just so cute and some nice embroidered flowers and crisscrossing um but yeah i just want to like bake bread whenever i wear this vest it's so sick and i got this pashmina just the other day this is my most recent find um but it's like the most gorgeous pashmina i have ever laid eyes on this is my i like this side more personally but this is my this is my pashmina i love it it's like a nice warm hug yes I also have this dress, which I think is also vintage because it's made in the United States. And sometimes you can just tell um, by the tag. This is called California Concepts um, and also just the material. I don't know. I go thrifting a lot, so finding vintage items is pretty fun because like true vintage versus <laughs> like 2000s vintage, I think. Or that's not even really vintage in my opinion, 2000s clothes. That's besides the point. I got this first pair of shoes. It's just a nice pair of boots. Um, they're from the brand Ugg, but I got them and they're like fleece lined or whatever. Um, but I got them for like 10 bucks at a thrift store up north. And they're so cozy and nice for whenever I go on day trips and it's cold outside. Um, I don't really like buying leather, or I don't ever buy leather firsthand. Um, I don't even know if this is real leather, but I feel like Ugg usually uses real leather. Um, but yeah, I just don't ever buy it firsthand, but I don't see a problem with doing it when it's secondhand, so. And these, I love these bad boys. Um, these are Doc Martens, obviously. Um, I don't, I'm not really sure what the style is, but it's like pretty popular style. I got them off of Depop and it's nice because they're the ones that are made in England. So they're like super good quality. Not that the ones made in the United States aren't, but I don't know. Anyways, these are like my all-time favorite shoes right now. I also have the brown Mary Jane pair that I also got off Depop. Chef's kiss. Those are like the only two pairs of shoes that I wear other than like my hiking boots and Birkenstocks. Next is this skirt. It's got a cool like symmetrical kind of hem. Um, yeah, and it's got ruche in the back. Usually I fold it over because it's kind of long and I don't, I don't know, kind of like it a bit shorter. But I like this skirt with this vest. I kind of feel like I'm a waitress at like True Food or something, um, but it's so cute. This is my all-time favorite shirt and it is this green one with these cool animal skulls on it. I think it's just like super sick and I'm never super oversized as well, which I really like about t-shirts. Um, and this is by The Green Project. And then last, but certainly not least, this is my personal personal favorite of the haul although there's so many good <laughs> so many good items in this haul Doo -doo -doo -doo. it's this dress it is so beautiful and just everything i would ever want in a dress it's got kind of not like mesh but kind of see-through sleeves and then a nice crisscross detail in the front with beautiful embroidery and then obviously this like sick yellow and green tie-dye. I think it's just so super sick. 
And then this is by the brand Cute Options. Anyways, that was my haul. If you guys want like thrift or a lookbook, <laughs> do people still do those? An outfits video, if you guys still want, want them, those or like see how I styled these, let me know. Usually it's just my friends that watch these, so you guys can just send me a text if you want. <laughs> um, but yeah, that has been my wardrobe over the past six months and obviously my old clothes. I feel like I'm finally finding what I actually like to wear and clothes that make me feel cool and confident at the same time. So thanks for tuning in. I kind of just post sporadically, but if you like this video, feel free to give me a like, comment, subscribe. I do all sorts of stuff. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you have a great rest of your day and drink some water.